It means a program that can run on any platform or operating system. Someone may say that program written in C or C++ can also run on any platform, but in fact, the program should be recompiled when transferred from one platform to another. It means the program written in C or C++ are portable, that is the source code need to be ported to another platform and compiled to make it executable on the new one platform. How can we say that Java is a platform independent language? It is a big question and all and most of the time for the Fraser students these questions are called during the interview and uh, problem is everyone knows C program can also be transferred from one environment to another. The C program is also having uh, capacity to execute on Windows or Linux or another uh, environment. So we cannot say that since Java, Java program can be uh, executed on any environment like Windows, Mac OS, uh, Linux, so it is platform independent. Because the, the question may arise that uh, C is also a programming language whose program can be transferred from one environment to another environment, any other operating systems can have the same program and it can be compiled into machine code into machine code and can be executed but the question is uh, can we uh, transfer this executable code from windows to linux or from windows to any other operating system no it is not possible because this is a machine dependent code and it cannot be transferred from one operating system to another however we can say that the uh, same c program uh, can be transferred from uh, one environment to another with some little changes if needed uh, to any other operating system and uh, it has to be recompiled and then it can be executed on that environment only. But for the case of Java, there is a Xavium available for all the operating system. And uh, the dot .java program after compilation through Java C becomes dot class file and this dot class file is neither source code nor machine code. The dot class file is a white code or intermediate code which is understandable by the JVM. So if there is a JVM installed on your operating system then that dot class file can be transferred to any of the operating system and can be executed by that JVM. So we can say that this JVM is heavyweight, this JVM is dependent on platform of, uh, but the Java program is platform independent because the compiled code can be transferred from one operating system to another without having any changes or without uh, doing recompilation. We can say C a portable language because the source code can be transferred from one environment to another, but the Java program is both the uh, portable as well as uh, platform independent portable because the java code can be transferred from one operating system to another and it can be decompiled and executed however the dot class file which is a, a compiled or byte code that can be also transferred from one environment to another and it can be executed by the jvm available on that operating system so this jvm and the byte code makes the java program a platform independent language 
compilation and execution. When a Java program uh, is compiled, it creates a dot class file, which is neither source code nor a machine code. It is an intermediate code known as bytecode. This bytecode runs over Java Virtual Machine. The same bytecode can run on any platform if JVM exists there, as JVM knows how to interpret that bytecode and execute it. Summary. Uh, in summary, we can say Java is a portable as well as platform independent language. Portable because the same source code can be transferred from one platform to another, compiled and interpreted. Platform independent? It is because the bytecode generated after compilation can be transferred to another platform. There is no need of recompilation on another platform. The same bytecode can be executed on different platform only if JVM exists. JVM is platform dependent, heavy width, that means, uh, because it converts bytecode into machine dependent code that is platform specific. So different versions are available for different platform like Windows, Linux, Solaris and so on. In summary, the bytecode and the JVM makes the Java a platform independent programming language.